Bye, I guess. Why the fuck him? You were here for literally five seconds. I thought Are you wanted me to leave. No, it was a oh my god alive, someone please kill me. <laughs> Several hands go up. It was a joke. Where are but I was parking to get to his house. You don't want me to leave? No, we're indifferent. These people fire lava creatures? Okay. Chloe, how have you lived how old are you? Twenty three? How have you lived twenty three years without like suffocating of retardation? First of all, I'm pretty. Don't answer him, Chloe. Oh no, you asked him, David. Or... <laughs> Chloe. <laughs> I love you, buddy. Chloe. I am asthmatic. <laughs> Chloe. Yes. Don't answer him. I, I know solicitors. And, uh. Not... Yep. We like to get you into trouble, but don't answer him. <laughs> okay. Um. I won't. No comment. But... No comment. I. I. <laughs> <laughs> it kills her not to be able to talk. Yeah, yeah, imagine now that she's in trouble. No comment. Uh, yeah, if I do <laughs> Can I have one? Can I make one? <laughs> yeah, can I make one? <laughs> I'm 25, not 25. <laughs> That's the one you want to make. Imagine doing 12 hours of talking to fucking absolute subhumans <laughs> and finishing work and coming home to speak to absolute subhumans. <laughs> yeah, but one of them is my choice, so what does that say about you? <laughs> Hurt me, daddy. I've been sleeping, like, all day. I, woke, I went to sleep at, like, after 3 a.m. and then woke up at, like, 1 this afternoon. And then I had an accidental nap at half past five and woke up at half past nine. <laughs> you sound like an old person. Oh yeah, just had an accident and not again. <laughs> well, okay, listen, don't tell anyone, but I got a message from my mum asking if I was going to cook tonight. And I didn't feel like cooking, so I pretended to be asleep and then I actually fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, <David>. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do it. I'm gonna finna pretend to sleep. <laughs> That's yeah, a no, brilliant yeah. tactic. Don't worry, I, I haven't clicked it, and I won't send it to anyone. Oh, that'd be hilarious. <laughs> and then record the reaction. <laughs> record her being beaten. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm worried at how much joy that gave me. I know, you. David loves <laughs> parental abuse, apparently. Uh, yes. Yeah, so what was you on about um, the voice acting and that, anyway? It's crap. Like, what? how crap? Did they pretend to be like uh, Ben English? Yeah? Well, yeah, they pretend to be. They're, they're like it, 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 it's obviously fake English accents. It's just it's just really uh. Ben. Yep. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> no, Ben actually has an English accent. Oddly enough, not with him being English. Yeah, it's strange. Hmm. A fucking hang in that is that I've got a fucking English accent. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bumping. <laughs> That's bumping, Alice, boy. You've got an English accent. I'll let you know. <laughs> I don't know. Worst part is Ben sounding more fucking worse than you. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, fucking you know. hell. That's it. Like, I can't even do a fucking accent. I'm fucking born and bred. <laughs> born and fucking inbred. <laughs> Maybe you'll finally come out. Oh. Never mind, fuck it. Nice. Don't give fucking follow your dreams. Nice. <laughs> Try and do something nice, say something nice for someone. Like, hey, don't doubt yourself, give it a go. Well, you're gay. <laughs> well, <fuck. laughs> I don't have to defend you, go back to fucking Africa. <laughs> <laughs> right, granted, right, they're still selling two things I like. Sometimes I like a can now, and sometimes I, like, I, I always smoke. Sometimes I always smoke. <laughs> 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 I could legit leave Raccoon and Matthew in a room and just watch, and I'd get endless entertainment out of it. You I like two AI programs talking to each other, <laughs> 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 just arguing and saying nonsense. What the hell do you have against my tree? 
I know. I'm not gonna deny. I wanted to start an OnlyFans, right? And but then completely shut up. <laughs> and completely rip people off, right? When they decided to subscribe, subscribe to me, mm. and only show desktop fans, ceiling fans, and everything. And then when someone's like, "Oh well, you should show your body," well, you can't get any more more pure body than a ceiling fan, can you? Like going to. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. And I, I'm from Africa. I've heard a lot of ridiculous things. Listen, <laughs> you, you have to be ridiculous. And then when someone's like, can I have a, can I have a refund? This, this is for only fans. And <laughs> I've got them. I've only ever displayed fans. Not. Um. Well, I have something to tell you. Oh no. Hmm. Wow, okay. okay. I won't compliment Ben, it's fine. <laughs> Go on. Yesterday I was feeling a little a little anxious and overwhelmed. Jack will know. Now, I don't get anxious. I'm not an anxious person. I'm usually just far too apathetic to get anxious. Um but I I had a moment and I was kinda sad. And then I joined the Discord, and you guys were just laughing, and it cheered me up, and it was nice and wholesome, and thank you. We were laughing at you. <laughs> I'm never being nice again. Everybody was down. I don't know. I... <laughs> Give me my mum was talking about you in my videos and how much she loves you and your laugh. Aww. I was like, yeah, it's a shame she's my mortal enemy really, isn't it? <laughs> Do you know when the Amazon Black Friday thing is, by any chance? I've narrowed it down to a Friday. <laughs> I'm fine. Bum, 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 bum. Um. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just. I've had KFC today. Oh, that's so, why you're uh, so energetic, energetic. I had it about what, two hours ago. No. <laughs> well, the last time. But did you have gravy? No. You didn't have gravy? Oh, gross. Oh, <laughs> gravy's the best part of it! Do you want to say that any higher? Really? I don't think I don't think my next thing is dog here, do you? <laughs> Bitch. Oh. But also, no, no gravy. The gravy's the best part. And if you disagree with that, then I I'm, think you'll I'm find. Glad, I'm glad that we broke up. <laughs> I think you'll find the chicken is the best part of the Maggie think Fried chicken. You'll find the. <laughs> You are wrong. And I think you'll find that the gravy is disgusting. I, I think you are egregiously wrong, and you are making a grave mistake. A by grave putting mistake. A, a group. Fuck off. <laughs> I don't know how old your mother is. Four hundred year old woman would know about it like that. Mom. <laughs> no, don't tell her that. <laughs> Jack, Jack. Jack said. I didn't realise that. Well, I don't know how old your mother is. I didn't realise a 400-year-old woman would know a band like that. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, yeah, your mic's not good enough to pick that up. Damn it! Hang on. I'm taking my headphones off. Oh, God. <laughs> With age comes experience and knowledge. Ah. Uh. What was the response? She'd know. <laughs> <clears throat> A disturbing journey, deep into the realms of mistruth and deception, to reveal the many tricks and subterfuges used, used by the British Broadcasting Corporation. <laughs> Christ. Every time yeah, we engage with BBC yeah. content, the author <laughs> argues, we are exposing ourselves to a very dark art, the art of brainwashing. Ha ha ha. 
willful, deceitful, and incessant Orwellian parallels define the modern corporation and should chill the soul of all who cherish freedom and liberty. Mind control is here. This is not fiction. BBC brainwashing Britain? This is a shocking expose of mass propaganda, its components and aims. You may never look at Auntie in the same way ever again. Social media quotes are reproduced in their original form in this book, and US media quotes use US spelling, and they therefore contain errors. <laughs> Whenever my pastor went on holiday, he would have like one of the like two or three people that he, he trusted to sit his house for him. So they, they'd live downstairs in their house, uh, sleep it, and they have a, a spare room in the basement, so they sleep down there. So one time it was Joel, it was Joel's turn. So Joel is sleeping there and like just chilling out and using it as a, as a poker den more than anything. Uh, and by the time Paul came back, all the drawers were switched around. Oh no. Like every, like, you know, the cutlery drawer was switched over with the like cup drawer or whatever, the towels were in it. Like he basically took out all the drawers of the kitchen and just moved them. No. So, when Paul came back and went and he like put a coffee on, I was like, oh, you know, long, long travel day or whatever. Bungs the kettle on, <clears throat> goes to get a spoon from the drawer that's normally there, opens it, and there's towels. <laughs> and it, <laughs> that's my kind of prank. Yeah. I also, it doesn't work with everyone, it would work with you. But the thing I would do is like, I'd make every picture slightly crooked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I intentionally make the posters in my flat slightly crooked. No, actual physical cunt. <laughs> I know that men enjoy being sucked. I broke my nail trying to break into something. I was trying to break into a shop. Weird, because I can fit a hangover lot in my mouth. No.